you know so one of the things we're working on is that how do we actually capture this information and therefore put together much more of like an intuitive commissioning structure where rather than looking at the commissioning of a child's needs based on an annual review or based on um, i don't know um a, a strategic commissioner could look at the needs of a service after you know the, the tender process so normally a, a tender contract is anything between five and seven years they review everything that's too long if you've got the right analytics and the right process and power and support that facilitates it if a child's progression is gone you can record it and see in terms of how well they're how well they're doing based on the work or how not well they're doing or how less engaging that the, the the system or the structure of the curriculum is then you can use this information to structure in terms of how to play and not to play in terms of your progression we use it for example look at um apps for trading you get these insights all the time in terms to understand how much um, you can buy or sell stocks or commodities or anything like that to gain some sort of capital advantage. Yep. That same framework can be utilised in education if you have the information that's there. So again, these are the type of things where I always say, yes, we're living in austerity. Yes, there's restricted funding, but we're not smart how we utilise this money. 